hello friends welcome back to my channel in this video i will show you how to fix limbus company game crashing at startup on pc or not launching or not opening or showing black screen error or not loading error on pc so let's go ahead the first solution is to check system requirements to play limbus company game for that go to steam click on store search for the game and then go below and here you can find out the best requirements that is re needed for the game to play on your system check it and then try to play the game the second solution is to restart your pc or steam to restart steam simply go to steam click on steam option and then click on exit after this click on windows icon then click on power and here select restart this will restart your pc and once done launch the game and check if you can play the game the next is to run game as administrator for that go to steam go to the library section select the game right click on it select properties and then click on install files after that click on browse option this will take you to the path where the game has been installed select the application right click on it and select properties now click on compatibility tab and here you have to click on run this program as an administrator and then click on apply and ok now check if this works otherwise click on run this program in compatibility mode 4 and select windows 8 and then check if it works or you can also select windows 7 if not you should disable full screen optimization by clicking here and then click on apply on and ok now check if the issue is resolved the next solution is to verify integrity of the game files for that go to steam under library section select the game right click on it, the game select properties go to the install files and click on verify integrity of game files after verifying the game files try to play the game and check if it works the next solution is to modify launch option go to steam under library section select the game you have downloaded select properties under general in the launch option type minus dx11 and then check if this resolves the issue if not then type minus dx12 and now check if this resolves the problem the next is to allow limbus company through firewall for that you simply go to the search option look for windows defender firewall this type of interface will open click on allow an app or feature through defenders firewall now click on change settings here look for the game that is already added or you can simply add here after this once you find your game make sure private and public boxes are ticked and after the click on ok and then check if this method has resolved the issue the next method is to update graphics card for that simply go to the search option look for device manager go below go for display adapters right click on it and then click on update driver here click on search automatically for drivers this will update the best drivers for your pc and once done now check if you can play the game without any error or i have provided the link in the description go through the link as per your pc requirements and download the latest drivers 
Next is to clear download cache. For that, you simply need to go to Steam. Click on Steam. Then click on Settings. After that, go below and click on Download option. Now, here, go below and here you can see clear cache option. Simple, simply click on it and this will clear the cache. After this, launch the game and try to play the game. Next solution is to disable in-game overlays. For that, go to Steam, under library section, select the game, right click on it, select properties. Under general, you can see enable the Steam overlay while in-game option is enabled. Simply click on it and disable it and then try to play the game and check if this solution works for you. The next is to close unwanted background task. For that, simply click on task manager under processes tab you need to check if any unwanted app is running in the background simply select it right click on it and click on end task option this will close the app and after that try to play the game and check if it works the next solution is to update windows for that simply go to the search option here look for check for updates option this will open the windows update interface here you should check if any update is needed by simply clicking on check for updates option and update your windows to the latest version if it is required and then try to play the game the next solution is to run game on dedicated graphics card for that go to the search option look for graphic settings here you need to add an app so can click on add desktop app and go to the folder where your game has been installed so simply go click on steam go below click on steam apps and click on common here you can see the game folder simply open it and add the game app here now you can see the game has been added simply click on the arrow icon under gpu preference here you need to click on high performance and once it's done now check if you can play the game without any further problem the next solution is to install visual c++ files for that i have provided the link in the description just open it in your browser and download and install the C++ files on your PC as per requirement. The next is to change virtual memory settings. For that, you simply go to the search option. Look for view advanced setting. Click on it. Under performance, click on settings. Go to the advanced tab. Under virtual memory, click on change option. Now disable this tick mark and then click on custom size. In the initial size, you should write 24576, 24576 and in the maximum size is 49152 if your PC is having 16 GB RAM or if your and then click on OK and then Restart your PC and check if this resolves the issue. If not, then the final step you need to follow is to reinstall Nimbus Company game. For that, simply go to Steam, go to the library section, select your game, right click on it, click on manage and then click on uninstall option. After that, click on uninstall and then this will remove the game from your system. Now reinstall, restart your PC. And then relaunch the game by reinstalling it once again in your system. Once done, check if this process has resolved the problem. Hopefully, all these solutions will work effectively to fix the issue 